But fundamentally, there's a real danger there. If you're a business owner listening to this and your teams are considering using generative AI to create their posts, it's obvious is what I'm going to say when that's the main part of the process. There has to be human element in there, substantial human element in there, and an investment of time. That investment of time is the hardest part to carve out because they've got a million and one other things to be doing. And I totally get that. And that's why I'm such a big advocate for the video-based interviews that I use all the time because that's how I can create, you know, in 30 minutes of my time or your time or 15 minutes or an hour, however long you've got. And it's content that's probably already there somewhere. You've probably been on a webinar. You've probably got a podcast. You've probably... Um, done some um, talks for, for clients or, or whatever behind the scenes. It's probably already there to a certain extent. 30 minutes of your time on average a week, a fortnight, a month, doesn't matter. That can be turned into so many different forms of content from audiograms and visualizers to quartz images to short 30 second reels um, in landscape, in square, in portrait format. And newsflash, technology makes that relatively simple to do. A bit of an investment of time up front. Again, it's that investment in time. Not everybody has it. Not everybody wants to make time for it. And we struggle to prioritize it. But if you've done that groundwork, all of a sudden your team has two or 300 digital assets that they can post out across all of their social media channels without too much repetition of each other. 